Don't call me cause I'm unavailable Got nothing but up in my schedule But fun Trying to get wasted isn't difficult If you ain't with it then just stay at home We'll act like the rich kids now So broke but we'll paint the town So go ahead and leave your message at the tone Cause baby I'm so unavailable I am in New York. It's a beautiful day. I'm with my mum. It's our third time in New York together. I had to do a vlog. We got here yesterday, but we were so jet lagged and tired that I just couldn't face vlogging. Um, we did a little bit of shopping. We went to Macy's. I feel like it's something you just have to do. Although I wouldn't say it's the most pleasurable experience going to Macy's, would you? But it's just something we feel like we have to do. Um, and we also went to Ellen Stardust Diner last night, which I went to last time. I just did not have the energy to vlog. So we're starting today and we're having a shopping morning. We're going back to our favorite department store, which is Lord & Taylor. Last time we were in New York, we were staying. Our hotel was on the same um, road as Lord & Taylor. So we would go shopping and just go back to the hotel and put our shopping in the hotel and go back out. So, oh. <laughs> And then, this afternoon, we have tickets for Anastasia! Which I'm so excited for. Wasn't Anastasia my favourite oh, thing when I was little? Like, more than any Disney film, yeah. it was Anastasia. So what I'm really on the hunt for is for some brown over-the-knee boots that will actually stay up. Because I don't have any right now. The ones I thought were going to stay up don't. So, the only thing I really want to go shopping for is boots. So hopefully Lord and Taylor have some. So we just got to Lord and Taylor and it turns out that they're closing down and they're having a gigantic sale and everyone is literally waiting, I think, for the store to open to go in. So I don't know what's gonna happen. All pair of shoes today. Okay? Thank you very much. We got deals for everybody, so be nice and enjoy. We're glad you're here. Thank you so much. So I literally feel like I'm in confessions of a shopaholic. This is what they do. They send out a leaflet and then everyone goes crazy. <laughs> Everyone's queuing outside now, there's a huge crowd. Oh my god, we've just stumbled into some luck here. <laughs> we had no idea. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. It's a stampede. Oh my god, it literally is a stampede. Oh my god. I'm in confessions of a shopaholic. Like, seriously. Oh my god, I'm scared. Okay, I'm scared. Okay. What's going on? Are these nice? There was a moment of madness just then. It's hysterical. Guys, I'm so upset. I found the perfect boots. Look how perfect they are. They fit so nicely, except they're too small. They're a five and I'm a five and a half. And I can just feel like as I'm walking around, they're, they're just gonna be too small. Like after 10 minutes, they're gonna hurt. So, oh my God, I'm so upset. And it's like a jumble sale. Everything's separated by size. So it's all completely random. Um, it's kind of sad because this was like my favorite department store and now it's gone. Well, it's going. So yeah, how devastating is that? I'm like, should I get them anyway and just have painful feet? But it's probably not the answer. We've given up on shoes. We're going down to dresses. How beautiful are the lifts? It's actually such a shame this is closing, isn't oh, it? It's, awful. it's such a nice How place. Do I around there? Oh. <laughs> okay. We're abandoning ship. It's too much. It's like a jumble sale, which is really sad because we could probably get some really good deals. Um, they had a Carl Lagerfeld dress that was pink tweed it was so nice and it was only $20 but I just couldn't look for my size it was too much so um yeah we're gonna head out now to oh it's such a nice day so this is Fifth Avenue now so I mean we could just walk up Fifth Avenue to Bloomingdale yeah and then if there's any shops along the way it's quite a long way yeah but it's nice to see the sights yes. um and it's not that cold either like it's cold but it's really not bad so yeah, that lens flare. Oh yeah. <laughs> tradition <laughs> getting some honey roasted almonds mmm yum we're in Grand Central Station now we kind of abandoned Bloomingdale's because it was a really long walk and we just love it here so much it's incredible we're just in a taxi 
see you on the way to the theatre. I'm so excited. I can't wait to see Anastasia. I hope it's good. Oh no, you're gonna have to stop me from singing. Stop you, you're gonna have to stop me. <laughs> Welcome to the Broadhurst Theatre. Thank you, and enjoy the show. Okay, I just have to say, and I don't say this lightly at all, because we see a lot of shows, don't we? A yes. lot. That's the best thing I've ever seen, ever, ever and ever will see. On it, I actually feel like crying. I know. It, I was crying. Oh yeah, so, yeah no. so was I. It's oh, nothing, I can't, I, I've got no words. I really want to get the music box that they're selling in the merchandise, but my mum says no. <laughs> she won't let me, although I am 24, I think I can make my own decisions, but no. I really want to get it. You're not having it. Why? I'm going to get it. No. We're just having a little stroll, looking for somewhere to have dinner. The marathon was just here, and there's a few people still running. <laughs> so I'm going to end the vlog here for today. Um, I'm still quite tired, so we're just going to have some dinner and go to bed. But I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Good morning, everyone. So we're on day two, and sadly, it is pouring down with rain all day. So our plans of a nice walk around Soho and Greenwich Village. Uh, aren't really gonna work out today so we're just in a car headed to Bloomingdale's for some more shopping we just want to do some nice indoor things today so we might go to the Natural History Museum or Museum of Natural History <laughs> the other way around here um, so yeah hopefully we can still make the best of it um, I hate the rain and I I can't walk around in the rain I just can't so um, yeah we'll see what we get up to we're here look at this rain not ideal just need to see the rain like it's ridiculous it's so sad because every time we've been to new york we've had perfect weather every time haven't we it's never rained when we've yeah. been here never so um i'm in my nice cozy victoria secret coat my mom's in her matching black one <laughs> so yeah let's go inside and hopefully find some good over the knee boots as well fingers crossed <laughs> yes. oh my god the christmas music has really cheered me up <laughs> I was so sad about the rain. It's Christmas in New York. Remember? Oh, we're getting him. <laughs> we're having it. <laughs> so, it seems like Bloomingdale's was a little bit more successful because I found the perfect over the knee boots they're not brown which is what i was looking for but they are honestly perfection um they're literally everything i'm looking for in a pair of boots and i'm also gonna get these for coco because you guys know she's obsessed with cardi b she literally sings i like it every single day and she said to me i really want the balenciaga spready so these are steve madden ones so not as expensive as balenciaga but i know she's absolutely going to die so yeah we're gonna get these and these for me. I also thought you guys might appreciate my outfit today because I'm wearing black jeans, which is not like me at all. But I just thought they were really nice. They're from Zara and they're really comfy and it's really cold. So yeah, I'm wearing them just with my ankle boots and my little um, Majorelle top from Revolve, which is super duper cute. So we found these fur coats or faux fur. We love every single colour. They're all amazing. Obviously, I'm leaning towards this one. How amazing is it? I really need it. I don't actually have a nice warm winter coat. Like a nice one. Oh my god. It's so nice and soft. And it's perfect colour. It's so cute. And it's so warm and cosy. Oh my god. There's so many nice colours. My mum wants one as well. So, we're leaving Bloomingdale's with shoes but sadly, no fur coat. She did say there was gonna be a sale on tomorrow, so it'd be silly to buy it today. So we might come back tomorrow and get the coat, um, but for now, just shoes. So it's stopped raining. We've decided to come and do Top of the Rock. I've done it before, um, but it was at night, and I honestly think that there is something to be said for seeing like the city at night, but also it's a completely different experience seeing it in the daytime. My father never intended to build Rock Photo Center all by himself. But it became his crowning legacy and an enduring symbol of hope and optimism, of which all of his descendants are very proud. We're on the top of the rock! It's amazing. It's actually really cool because it's quite cloudy. So actually the top of the Empire State Building is like disappearing into a cloud, which is kind of cool. It's very cold. So here we are at the top of the rock. This is the very top deck crazy high look there's the empire state building that's disappearing into the clouds 
Chrysler building over there. Um, there's the river. Oh my god, it's so cold. <laughs> Guys, now I'm just waiting while my mum shops in Free People. This is her favourite shop ever and we just found a huge store in the Rockefeller Plaza. So we came in here for my mum but she found this dress and I couldn't resist trying it on. I said I wasn't buying any summery clothes, I was only going to buy warm wintry clothes but it's so pretty. Sorry, we just got back to the hotel room. We couldn't vlog because it was just pouring down with rain. But we just stopped off to get some bagels and some cakes. And we're just going to chill out in the hotel for a couple of hours before our show because we got King Kong tickets, which we're so excited for. Watching a bit of Dance Mums, of course. And um, this is our room, actually. I'll just quickly show you. We're staying in the HGU Hotel, which is in Midtown. It's really pretty. Um, I love the grey walls. It has like a really clean design and these cute little doors. Nice big wardrobe space. Um, over here is the bathroom and then please do excuse the mess um, <laughs> but here's our little living room area it's very dark that's the only thing there's no like natural light that comes in here at all all our luggage is everywhere we brought five suitcases in total a couple of them were empty for potential shopping and then here is the bed nice big bed we're sharing um, with our food on I know it's really messy but um, yeah a little hotel room tour it's really pretty. I would definitely like to stay here again. It's a really good location as well, isn't it? We, it's really easy to get to everywhere. It's kind of, well, it's midtown, so it's in the middle of everything. So, um, yeah, I'm going to get on, eat our food and have showers, get ready for the theatre. Well, we are feeling much refreshed after our bagels and shower. And we're currently walking to the theatre because we got tickets to King Kong, which my mum is Yay! extremely excited about. I'm sure it's going to be really good. Um, but yeah, I must say, I think I've nailed dressing for the temperature. I've got my knitted dress on from Free People, my over knee boots, my scarf, and my cape. Here we go! Oh my gosh! Wow. It looks really cool! So we just came up to the theatre at King Kong and I ran into Dimitri, well, this is Zach, who plays Dimitri yeah. Anastasia, and okay. it was just the best, best, best thing I've ever seen. It was meant it. to be, we were meant to be. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, I just think everyone, everyone should go see it. It was wonderful. Yeah, so come much. on, bye. <laughs> bye. bye. Guys, I just met Dimitri. Dimitri, yes. The Dimitri. He was lovely. What an amazing theatre! Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. So this is the Broadway theatre. So I don't know if this is, I guess, pretty famous, but it's beautiful. So it's the interval, and I just had to check in. <laughs> I am gobsmacked. Literally gobsmacked. I was in hysterics the whole way because I was in shock. I can't believe what I've just seen, and it's only Act One, so yeah, it was incredible. And I just couldn't stop laughing because I was just shocked. It was so, so good. I'm, I'm lost for words. <laughs> lost for words <laughs> this room look at the bathroom oh my goodness oh my gosh i can't believe we're staying here <laughs> good morning so i ended the vlog a little bit abruptly last night because it was just a little bit of a whirlwind we were checking into our new hotel 
and we had to go out to a dinner so you're probably all really confused um about why we changed hotels so i'm actually here on a trip with victoria's secret for their annual fashion show which this year is in new york so yeah it's the most exciting thing ever um but me and my mum decided to fly out a few days early to enjoy you know new york and have our own little trip um before the Victoria's Secret event started. So that's why we changed hotel and from now on the whole trip is pretty much all about Victoria's Secret. We have a little bit of spare time in between events um, and we're gonna make the most of it and go to the park. It's a beautiful day today, thank goodness, not like yesterday. This morning we are headed to a workout with Megan Roop who actually trains the angels and it's a train like an angel workout class. So I'm kind of nervous because I think it's gonna be really hard um, but I am excited as well because I definitely need to work off all those brownies that I ate last night. So so yeah, I need to get out of my PJs, get into my VS gym wear and head to Equinox. So we're just at Equinox, about to start our train like an angel workout. I'm kind of nervous. Look at my outfit though. So cute. Um, I feel like I'm not going to look like this at the end though, or even in five minutes. So wish me luck. Maybe find an outfit for tonight or for the show tomorrow. It's all Christmassy, the fashion show. Oh my god, I can't believe we're going. I really can't. I can't. Yeah. Here we go. I open the door for you. So much cuteness. It's so Christmassy. There is literally so much I want to get. Pajamas. Look at these scarves over here. Really soft, wintry scarves. All this amazing sportswear. Oh my god, there is too much. Here we are at the Angel Suite. So beautiful. Let's go inside. We're just getting fitted. Apparently I'm a double D, which I would not have thought, but I've put the bra on and it is so comfy. So yeah, I definitely want to get this one. It's not wired and it's just super, super comfy. I'm pretty, I love this color. This is all our stuff. We just went on a spree. So I'll show you what I got later back at the hotel room, but we got some amazing bits. I'm so happy. We've come to Central Park. Is the light weird? No, it's okay. So we've come to Central Park. We had a couple of hours of free time, so we just kind of came for a stroll. Hopefully, we can go ice skating, because um, I've always wanted to go ice skating in Central Park. We found it, it's here. Oh my gosh, I love it already. show you guys the stuff that I got from the store today so um first of all uh, there are just a couple of pairs of knickers in here <laughs> I got these for Coco because they have unicorns on and they're so cute and then I just got these ones for me because I have the bra and I got the matching little pants um I also got these slippers which are just so cute <laughs> look they're fluffy and they have pink velvet bows they're so gorgeous oh yeah this beautiful little eye mask it says angel in diamonds. 
Um, okay, so I got these pajamas, which I'm so excited by because they're like this amazing pink, fluffy, kind of like jumper material and the shorts, like these hot pants in the same material. They are so, so pretty and soft and cozy. I also got my favorite Victoria's Secret perfume, Oh So Sexy. I love this so much, literally it is the best one. And then I also got my sister a little um, like spray, body mist, and also the body lotion to go with the perfume. And then in this bag, also by the way, in the US they're paper bags, in the UK we have plastic ones. Um, so I got these leggings that go with the body that I'm wearing now. They're the same fabric um, and they're really, really comfy. I think I'm going to wear these on the plane home. Then I got another pair of pyjamas. Uh, this is the top, which is just really cute. It says VS in Diamante and it's long sleeved and really nice and soft. And then the bottoms are these pink crushed velvet like kind of joggers, which are so, so cute. I'm literally gonna wear these all the time, just around the house. And then I got my sister something else. I got her these leggings, which are sport leggings, but she'll just wear them, you know, as normal leggings. They're extra small, so hopefully they'll fit her. Then I got this bra, which I was fitted in, and it feels amazing. Um, it's got no wire, but it has this seam, so it kind of has support without um, having like the discomfort of a wire. And it's got this cute little V and diamonds, and it's just really, really flattering. Like. It just looks really good and feels so comfortable. Um, and then the final thing I got is this scarf. I just couldn't resist. I don't know, I just thought it was adorable and it's super, super soft and cozy as well. So um, yeah, I think I'm probably gonna wear this tomorrow when we go out. So yeah, that's everything I got. I'm so happy. I can't wait to put these fluffy pajamas on. I think they're gonna be amazing. But now I have to get dressed because we are going down for dinner in a minute. So guys, I'm all ready for dinner. I'm wearing this Victoria's Secret body that you saw in my video last week um, with the corset underneath, black jeans and these gas stilettos. Very fancy indeed. Um, so now we're heading to dinner. I'm so excited. I'm gonna miss this view so much. So beautiful. Um, but today is the big day. It's the day of the fashion show, um, which you know we've all been waiting for for so long, and it's just it's gonna be so amazing. So right now um, it's the morning, obviously, and we have to go to the venue where the show is later to pick up our tickets. That's what we're gonna do now, and then we have basically the whole day until um, the show. So I think we're gonna head to Soho. Greenwich Village area, maybe like Chelsea Market, something cool, like more downtown, um, and just spend the day there. It's another beautiful day. Um, a little bit chilly, but hoping it's gonna warm up. I'm gonna show you guys my outfit. So I'm wearing this hat from H&M, which is so cute with a little bubble. It's very Jenny Humphrey. Um, my Victoria's Secret coat. Um, this is like a turtleneck from Zara. It's just super cozy. Um, I've got my Zara snake print shorts my Gucci bag and my new boots that I got in Bloomingdale's the other day. They're so comfy, I love them. Um, so yeah, I'm all cozy and let's go. So I'm just backstage in a hair and makeup for the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show. It is so exciting. Like literally all the models in here I've seen Kendall, Gigi, um, Romy, all of them. Everyone's here just getting glammed up. Everyone looks amazing. Um, it's very, very exciting and it's all pink. <laughs> and it's got me so excited for later on. Um, yeah. Soho. This is like the place that my mum likes a bit more. I feel like I'm more uptown, she's more downtown. <laughs> I just love all the buildings in Soho. This area, they all have the fire escapes like on the outside and they're all in like really nice pale colours like cream and grey. Just looks lovely. Hey everyone, excuse my parents. We're in full swing getting ready for the fashion show. So I'm doing a face mask. This is an Elizabeth Arden one. I've got about 10 minutes left on this. I've curled my hair. I just need to do my makeup um, and put on my outfit, which I'm going to show you now. So I'm wearing this beautiful like corset top by Victoria's Secret. It is actually lingerie, but I'm wearing it as an outfit. I'm pairing it with this beautiful feather skirt. Um, I've had this for like two years and never worn it, and I was going to throw it away, 
but I knew that one day I would wear it and that is today. And then the bag I'm taking is this beautiful Aspinall of London trunk clutch. This is one of their new collaboration bags and I love how the feathers like connect to the skirt. I think it looks really, really cool. And then I'm wearing these like embellished heels from Guess, which I love. They're just super duper uncomfortable, so I'm a bit nervous, but I think the whole thing is gonna look really good. We also have to pack because there's an after party tonight. So we'll be back quite late and we have to be up at half past four in the morning. <laughs> for our flight home so yeah that's not going to be too fun i've got to take this face mask off get myself ready i've got like half an hour so I've got to be quick i'm all ready for the show oh my god i'm so excited here is my look my shoes are hurting already but you just have to go with it and i'm slightly over the top but so yeah, I don't think I can vlog inside. It's all super like top secret, no cameras, but you guys can watch it on TV and online in December. So make sure you do, it's gonna be amazing. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, so thank you so much for watching. It's literally been a dream come true to be here with Victoria's Secret, one of my favorite, favorite brands. So um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my New York vlog and I will see you soon.